champion of violence, bearing tides raw and sweet as bitten sores. A voice from the deep whispers, in your immortality, Eris Morn, may you never cease your demand for vengeance. I refuse. In time, I will destroy this hive form alongside the rest. Its power has no hold over me. Zibor Roth will not fall to might alone. Every clash of blades invigorates her. Even now she feeds, as she has fed since the first red cop, the first war song. Still, I savor every tithe. Their strength thrills me, and there are so many old debts to repay. But this is not the time. The cards speak of change. A ripple is cast. A great shadow rises from the sea of blood. Something is coming. of her battle song. Zebu Aroth's brood has come. We will make of my sister's court a battlefield! Shoot the Void Crystals to bring them down! are all that's left in your way. Bring them down, Guardian.
that there is only war. You prove my logic true. Meet me in blood. Match me in violence. How a brood will feed us with their tribute. Zivu Arath. When this is finished, you will turn and run, and your worm will gnaw at you as if you were a buried corpse. You will have no tribute then, and you will starve. This isn't over. Zivu will keep coming until she wins her war. We need to rethink our plan. No. Our plan needs no revision. All right, you're here. This is serious, so listen, and listen good. Zivu Arath's forces got into the throne world. This wasn't part of the plan, but it's bad news for everybody. Savathun's been hoarding powerful creatures in those summoning pits for a long time. Partially to study, but also to keep them out of the hands of her sister. If Sivu is able to take that extra power for herself, forget it! We're all dead! You need to claim those tithes. I hate seeing it all wasted on that weirdo heiress, but it's better than the alternative. Time to get to work, hero. discovered the spire. I saw heresy. A temple of the sky. I sought to destroy it. But now... I see truth. It is built on a foundation of death. A temple of the sword. Logic so pure. Even the warriors of the sky honor it. Rituals are discovered by the Eater of Weakness, the God of the Rotting Slave, Zivu Arath. Show her that the logic of the sword is no longer the hive.
at my feet. Turn your weapons against me, for I am the destruction you create! Sivu Arath would lay claim to all conflict. She is no longer the only high god strike. Rest these tributes from her grasp. What we are now. I
Leviathan Eater was testing your capabilities. He'll be back with reinforcements once Zivu's brood is assembled. Sometimes I think the boss believes in you more than her own brood. She left this for you. If the Guardians survive my sister's assault, it'll be on account of their ferocity, not their clemency. Zivu Arak will be thrilled. The Guardians will claim self-defense, of course. But that self-deception will only work for so long. Eventually, they'll have to admit, they live by the sword as much as my sister does. <laughs> it's so nice when the people we love all get along, don't you think? Guardian. I can hardly believe the tactical reports I'm writing. Vanguard forces, pursuing tithes to hive communed Eris Morn, have engaged Zivu Arath's troops in Savathun's throne world. We are caught between the sister gods of combat and lies and we're trying to resurrect the one who's caused us the most suffering. Even if we win, we lose. We accepted an impossible bargain. Savathun knew we couldn't defeat Zivu Arath. No one can win a battle against war itself. Eris understands this better than any of us. I know she's working on a plan. But I must still prepare for unexpected outcomes. If her transformation is influencing her judgment, how would I know? What could I even do to keep her safe? Guardian, be careful. We've lost so much to the Hive already. We can't let them take any more.